In the Palouse, Washington State defeats Wyoming tonight, 31 to 14, along with Jeremy Bloom. I'm Guy Haberman. And it was a first half offensively, somewhat unexpected, Jeremy, because it started with Wyoming and the deep ball. Yeah, nobody expected this. Kaufman to come out throwing play action pass, going deep for his man. That's a touchdown right there, number four, Tanner Gentry. And then Jake Mallhart would give them the lead back after Washington State scored. This from Dom Williams would tie it at 14. And then Keith Harrington, the longest run of the year for Washington State, 36 yards, would give them the 21 lead, a 21 to 14 lead. And then really because of their defense in the second half, they were able to put this game away. They were. Pelor, number 47, he was all over the football field for the Cougars, reading the eyes of the quarterback, reading the handoffs, stopping running plays behind the line of scrimmage, breaking up passes. He was really impressive. Wyoming ran for 113 yards in this game. Total offense, Wyoming actually had more than Washington State. Who would have thought that? But the interception there from Jeremiah Allison iced it. It was forcing turnovers. That ultimately was the difference for Washington State. So for the Cougars, they're now 2-1, and one, heading into a bye week before they visit Cal. 31-14, the final score in Pullman.